A-R-B testing turns opinions into evidence. Today you'll set a strong hypothesis, size the test, avoid common traps, and read results with both statistical and practical significance. Write a crisp hypothesis. Change X will increase metric Y for audience Z. Choose one primary metric. Add guardrails for quality, complaints, latency, so you don't win by breaking the experience. Define the minimum improvement worth shipping. Tiny lifts that don't pay back effort aren't wins. Randomize at the user level and keep variants mutually exclusive. Estimate sample size before you start, otherwise you'll chase noise. Run long enough to cover normal cycles. Weekday versus weekend, paydays, seasonality, so your result generalizes. Statistical significance says the effect is unlikely by chance. It doesn't say it's useful. Pair it with effect size and business impact. Also scan guardrails. If conversion rises but refunds spike, the win isn't a win. Don't peak and stop early. Pre-register your plan to resist bias. Avoid multiple unplanned comparisons. If you must explore, label it as exploratory and validate later. Prevent contamination. Users shouldn't see both variants. Document your test in a simple one-pager. Goal, variance, metrics, sample, result, decision. Clear hypothesis, correct randomization, adequate sample, and sober reading. That's trustworthy experimentation. Subscribe for more. Episode 9 will show how to dive into cohort analysis and retention.